22 games down now for Northern Ireland. What's your assessment of his, of his reign there so far? I think, to be fair, anyone who followed on from Michael O'Neill, it was going to be a tough ask initially because there was going to have to be young players coming in, trying to integrate them into the squad, trying to build confidence again, trying to get a system together, a different way of working under Michael. And you have to say Michael was very successful. So it was always going to be very difficult to maintain that. However, after 22 games, now in League C of the Nations League, there has to be progression in these next four games initially. We don't want to get too carried away or look too far ahead, but there is now an expectation from the supporters coming here tonight the Northern Ireland public that we have to win games that has to be the next step you've now got a squad together you have to win games you've got to do it on a regular basis and Ian said when he was asked about what his targets were for the next four games he's four games in 11 days David he said he wanted to win all four is that a realistic target with the squad that he has uh, it's going to be hard it's going to be tough again I know when Stevie's talking about sort of our international careers and whatever else that we never played four games in quick succession the way the, the, the players are doing so the squad depth is going to be tested um, but we, as a nation, uh, as a team, and I know Barra, spoke to Barra briefly yesterday, it's important that we start winning games now. Uh, we've had positive performances in, in, in some of the games. There's been games where I felt that we probably should have taken more points from and scored more goals. We haven't. But we don't want to be that team again. We were that team when we played at times where we were always unlucky or we always found a way maybe not to get the result. And we don't want to go back to that. He said that he wants to win all four, and possibly he should, as you pointed out, they're now in League C, Stephen. Is, that, is there a new factor now that he's going to have to deal with, which is, which is expectation? The fans will also expect him to win all these next four games. There is, but I think the players should embrace that. You know, get into football games expecting to win. I think that's a positive. You know, that's the energy that has to drive it. Now, and the players have to drive it. The one thing you get from this crowd here at Windsor Park, you get an atmosphere. They back you, you come out for the anthems, you come onto the pitch, they want to cheer you on. So I think it's vitally important you start the game strong. You start on the front foot, you're aggressive, you play in the opposition half, you try and force the game, you step forward into it. Don't step back, sink deep, and then allow the atmosphere to dwindle away. You have to use that energy early on to try and keep them on side.